All right, let's take a look at measure number one. Now, unless you started your lesson pack right here on this particular arrangement, you're already familiar, very familiar with this type of right hand movement. This is a bit of a reoccurring theme in, in lesson pack number three in our A modal tune arrangements uh, for the right hand. Anyhow, we have basic strum, let that fifth note ring out, pick up with the thumb. So there's a phantom stroke in there. And that takes us to the second measure of the tune. Here we're hammering on I'm uh, doing a basic strum, boom, chicka. Then we're catching this partial chord shape here. When I catch the second note there, it's the melody note, and then I throw this chord shape behind it. And if you're not making total sense of this chord shape yet, it's just a three note version, three finger version of what we normally play in a four finger arrangement. This is the F chord shape in your standard tuning and that's what we're doing here it's playing partial f chord now we're capo so that actually turns it into a g but for our purposes we're thinking in in g uh, this partial f chord so again we're playing to the chords getting some of the melody notes in there while we're at it do that measure for you one more time And that takes us to the third measure, which is the same as the first. And then we have the fourth measure. Nothing too crazy here. We have a hammer on. hammer on on a basic strum, then a drop thumb. It's a bit of a drop thumb roll there in the second half of the measure. We incorporate that second fret into that roll. Uh, that takes us to the second line, first measure. Here we have that half measure that we talked about in the melodic arrangement. This is a 2-4 measure, just two beats, just an open basic strum. And that concludes the A part, so we'd repeat all those, and then we move on to the second measure here in this line, and we get to the B part, which we'll only play once. We won't repeat this one. Uh, and again, we're playing a partial F chord here, so think about your big four note F chord. We're just playing these two notes here. I'm using a different fingering. I don't need to use my pinky since my other fingers are free. So we're just doing some basic strums here. <laughs> 